Hi Gemini's, welcome back to the channel. It's Scene Tarot. So we're going to jump into your reading to see what's going to happen in the next 48 hours. So if this does resonate for you, remember to like the video, give this video a big thumbs up here on the channel. All right. But if it doesn't resonate, I'll have your link, your playlist linked below. And also go over to the Instagram and support your girl. As soon as I hit the 5k mark, I'm definitely starting those free personal readings over there. So Gemini, let's get into it and see what's going on for you in the next 48 hours. For Gemini, please, in the next 48. Gemini in the next 48. Thank you, Angel. Next 48 hours for Gemini. You know, the funny thing is, Scorpio just had the same card. Honesty. Wow, number 26. What's going on with this one today? I feel like you guys have the same card. And you see me shuffling here. The angels want you to see this. I feel like there is going to be taking responsibility. There's going to be a new beginning in this 20, um, uh, 48 hours for you. I feel like there is going to be, you know, um, realizing what's in front of you and really just um, embracing and saying to yourself, okay, this is what I need to do for myself. This is what I did, taking responsibility of this and making it right and moving forward in your life. I'm seeing a new beginning here. I, f I feel like you have a light at the end of the tunnel, Gemini, honestly. Um, being honest with yourself is that number one factor. This is what I'm hearing, trusting your intuition as well, okay? Trusting who you are, the decisions that you're making. Look at that, the Ace of Wands. I feel like this is what this card reminds me of, and I said that into Scorpio's reading as well. And look at this, you know, a new beginning. This is what I'm hearing, but this is in reverse. So something here is in delay as well, all right? I feel like you, it's, uh, it's about taking responsibility and making that change and closing that chapter for you to actually move forward, for the energy to actually move with you. So tell me more, angels. What's Gemini 48 hours looking like? Okay. Wow. I'm going back to my jumper size decks, you guys. All right, so we have the chariot here, okay? We have the seven of pentacles. We also have the knight of cups, okay? We have the five of pentacles in reverse. I feel like Gemini, in the next 48 hours, you're definitely closing chapters here. You're definitely getting yourself on a schedule i'm seeing like you are paying your bills like you are making priority to clear things make a way for things again this this um honesty card you know it's more than just being honest with yourself or standing up for yourself self um awareness self self-respect you know it's it's more than that i just feel like this card is actually like a new light a new way like you're being led into um, a tunnel a dark tunnel here into the light i feel like you are going to be seeing your way very soon this is what i'm hearing but the first thing you need to take responsibility that is what the power of it all is okay and not doing the same thing again and again over and over again knowing that it doesn't feel right because you're doing it and you know within something is saying don't do this all right so we also have the knight of cups here which is this love that's coming into your life as well i feel like this person has to make a decision here but this person doesn't know where they lie or what they want to do or what they ha want for their future and this is kind of making things very hard for you in the next 48 hours i'm also seeing there's going to be some kind of investment with this person i don't know what this is it's like pleading for their case here when it comes to you pleading for another chance pleading for your love they're on their knees as you can see being very dramatic about things i I feel like you want to be with this person this is what i'm hearing and this person is moving very slow in the chariot acting like they don't know what they want for themselves and this is something that is a cycle it's going over and over again you're kind of sick and tired of this and i feel like you're giving this person like if you don't do this we are done 
kind of energy okay i feel like for some of you, you might be dealing with a cancer okay very dramatic energy and then we have the knight of cups scorpio cancer pisces energy all right i'm seeing like you're putting an end to things i feel like you feel empty or you feel used you feel like you know this person is actually taking advantage of you you feel like you don't have this person's heart okay as well and you're putting an end to this the Empress is also here. The Lovers is also here. The Death of Scorpio is also here. So Gemini, for some of you, could be messing with a Scorpio as well. Okay, the Knight of Cups is also... The Nine of Cups. I said the Knight. The Nine of Cups is also in reverse. So this person made you some promises that didn't come to light, didn't happen. Very much disappointed in this person. You know, that form of energy. I'm seeing something ended here between you and this person. And this person is having a hard time moving on. They don't understand why you're doing this. I'm hearing you knew about this. You knew about my situation. Why is it bothering you now? You know? I feel like, what's why is it bothering you? Because you're showing up as the empress. You're showing up as someone that you feel like you deserve so much more Gemini and you know your value and you're standing up for yourself now and this person if they don't like it they can go because there's so many people waiting and watching and hoping for you to be interested in them and you feel it and you know it but the lovers is here and I feel like this person is wanting to be with you I don't feel like this person is going to let you go that easily unfortunately for those of you who want to be single who want to forget about this person in the next 48 hours you can hear from this person in the next 48 hours hours with this lover being here this person is looking at your pictures your texts memories your things that you have left in the house maybe you left a sweater or shoes they're cuddling with it you know they're having it close maybe you left a bracelet a ring something to tie your hair up um a dress you you know or you left a uh, for the man out there you left your watch you wish you left your id something they're like really just holding on to that they really miss you they're thinking about you they want to be with you physically they want to make love to you and not only that i feel like this person wants to just cuddle with you but just don't know how to give you that hundred percent them at this present time okay but i feel like with you in the next 48 hours this is your big deal your honesty card be honest with yourself this is what I'm hearing. Someone needs to be really honest with themselves here, okay? And I feel like that's your energy, Gemini. That's you. The angels are saying, once you do this, everything else will fall into place because you know, you know that you deserve so much more. You see yourself having so much more. This, what this person can give you is not even half. They're stuck somewhere. It's like they can't move. It's like they're saying they can't really give you 100% of them because they're already stuck somewhere. You know, they can't move left. They can't move right. Okay. And they're pleading with you. I'm seeing this person crying in cancer a lot. They could even play the victim here. This is what I'm hearing. But they're going to tr like show some kind of investment. Okay. I don't know how they're going to do that with all of the chariot in reverse here. But they're showing some kind of investment, but this is not enough for you, the Seven of Pentacles. This is what I'm hearing. It's not enough because you're still ending things. All right? You want the Nine of Cups in the upright. You want everything that this person have promised you in the upright. This person promised you so many things and nothing has came to light. And they don't understand the value of what's really um, bugging you and why you're acting this way into death in Scorpio. It's like they don't understand, but they just want to move forward. But they don't understand, like, why are you doing this? Why are you acting this way? I just don't understand your emotions because you knew my situation. They're acting like it's not their fault. You know, it's like you need to understand this kind of energy. It's like they're blackmailing you here. Like you already know something. Hmm. Let me um, definitely use this white deck and see what we have here for Gemini in the next 48 hours. Gemini in the next 48 hours. Look at this. I am playful, curious. I'm a Gemini. So Geminis, you're probably seeing another Gemini. Tell me more. It that is so funny. You also have your energy here in the lovers. Gemini energy. You also have Virgo and you also have Scorpio in the death. You have Virgo in the um, Empress, okay? 
You have Cancer here too in the chariot. So your energy is here. I first, I you know what I'm getting, Gemini? Um, I'm getting like this um, connection was very playful. You were trying to have fun. You know, there wasn't supposed to be a real connection. And then it kind of like now you're asking for more. But this person doesn't understand like why. <laughs> I'm hearing that you will meet up Capricorn soon though. So watch out for that. But this is what I have for you in the next 48 hours, you guys. I hope it resonates. If it does, you know what to do. Like this video. Give this video a big thumbs up here on the channel. If it does not resonate, I will have your playlist linked below in the description. Also, go over to the Instagram, and I'll see you guys in your next video. Bye, guys.